Hello sugar plants, welcome back to my channel. Today guys, I'm going to be showing you how to transform this into something like this. Super, super easy video to make, but I saw those chargers and oh my God, they scream Christmas and I know I need to start preparing for Christmas because this is my all time favorite holiday. And today we're going to be using those beautiful red and gold flowers and I got them from this tablecloth. And guys, I had used this on my channel before showing you how you can use those beautiful tablecloth uh, flowers to put inside coasters and i had received a ton of requests asking me where i bought it but unfortunately i got this a while while ago probably like a couple of years ago and i cannot remember where i found it but anything that have like big bowl flowers you can use guys all i'm gonna be doing is uh, i cut out my flowers and then i'm using the bigger uh design flower they also have like smaller one that i use in my coaster but i'm taking the bigger one and like i did in my coasters i'm just gonna go use mud podge and glue them down inside a the charge blade and all i'm doing is adding mud punch on the back and also a little bit on the charger and now i'm just adding some on the edges of the flower just to make sure they stay completely flat and all i'm gonna do is let it skew for like about two hours and once the mud patch turn completely clear, I'm going to go ahead and start the next step. Super, super easy to do, guys. And now my mud patch is clear, but there's still a little bit of tackiness left to it. I'm just going to be using that beautiful maroon gold uh, mica powder. I love this gold, guys. If you use, ever use this in epoxy, it will float to the surface. Beautiful, beautiful. But this time, we're not going to put it in epoxy. I'm just going to use like a fluffy, small brush, and I'm just going to dip it uh, to my uh, inside the powder and directly on the um, charger plate we're gonna go ahead and start like putting it down and then you're just gonna rub it down guys and it will stick to the to the inside because I want the plate to be like these beautiful uh red and gold just like the flower but we're gonna just put the gold on the outer edge where we don't have the flower simple simple and if you don't have the maroon gold guys you can use any type of like gold marker powder that you have but again i'll leave the link for my amazon store inside the description box below and you can go and find all the product that i've used in this video minus of course the um the tablecloth now what i'm gonna be doing i'm gonna go ahead and add a little bit of shimmer in it it will then be christmas if it's not shimmery guys and you know i love glitter so i'm gonna be using uh red i'm just gonna put red glitter on it i'm not gonna put anything in the gold and for this red glitter, i'm, I'm using an extra fine glitter and the color is cherry this is a chunky glitter and both are from michael's i'm also gonna be using my dura uh dura clear uh, gloss varnish this method i've used it many many time on um on my channel it's just because it lets you uh give you a lot of work time if you were to do it with uh, um, epoxy instead uh, give you a whole lot more work time and you can play with it and if you get dry you can just add a little bit more gloss varnish in it and then you can you know keep playing with it so that way you don't waste a lot of products so I'm just gonna go ahead and using a small brush I'm just gonna add glitter only in the red part of the flower uh, of uh, you know inside uh, the plate now I'm not gonna do anything else I'm not gonna put gold glitter or anything Thing. I just want the red part to pop out because the red part of the charger is extremely vibrant and you know glossy I want to have that shimmer also in the center and that's all I'm gonna be doing I'm just gonna go ahead and let it cure and it's gonna dry for at least four hours four to five hours you can it will be ready to move on to the next step so that's what I did I went and let it dry for about five to six hours do it now I'm using my deco art a uh, color in gold to just kind of um, you know do the inside rim of the um of the plate i'm also going to be using it on the outer edge of the plate just to give it that beautiful low uh go also on the red from the outside i told you guys super easy and now I'm, what i'm doing is just um making my flower more pronounced by using the the metallic gold pen on only on the edge of where we have the flower meet uh, the gold part and this is making a lot of different guys because you know you have the marker powder that kind of you know flatten the the part of the outer edge of the flower but using the gold pen will make the flower pop up a lot more and all i'm using again is taking my gold pen and just like you all do a coaster just to the the gold edge of the flowers of the of the plate now the plate look like a big flower guys and i believe like um uh, what's this called that place uh, Z Gallery have like some something similar, and they are very expensive. I mean, in the same shape 
but beautiful 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 now because i'm gonna be using mine as a charger plate it's gonna be you know have like some plate sitting on top of it and i want to be able to clean it i'm gonna be using epoxy on it but if you're doing this as just like on some decoration that you're gonna put up you don't need to do that you can just use like a you know a glossy a spray um sealer and then you just uh, seal it down like this but i'm gonna be using epoxy on mine because i want to be using them as a charger plate now i just put epoxy you know in the center i'm just gonna go ahead and push it outside of the center so that way a little bit of epoxy gonna have um gonna fall into the red part and this is gonna create like another like um on a, a deeper red color where you have the epoxy resin sitting on the red and also i'm going to be using a, a small brush to kind of brush the epoxy on the uh, gold rim that i put on the plate just because i don't want it to come off this is hard plastic so it's not like crystal or you know anything like this so that's why i wanted to use the little bit of epoxy on it now a lot of people will say that epoxy doesn't stick to plastic it's just kind of depend on what plastic you're using this is a very hard plastic so epoxy do is you know stick to it it's not gonna come off um anytime soon or at all so this is that guys so all i'm doing after that you know i push make sure i have my epoxy set blow up the bubbles in my torch put my little um uh, with my little uh, paintbrush i'm gonna um, brush the epoxy on the side and we're gonna go ahead and let this sit and that's it we let it cure for 24 hours and this is the next day everything is nice and ready now how stinking cute is this guys everything is so beautiful now i'm showing you the uh, part that i have the epoxy showing you can see the red is more like a deeper and vibrant color you can use whatever on it you can use plate on it you can wash it again you're not gonna put it in dishwasher as you will not do your coasters but you can you know use soap and like a very nice soft uh, sponge or cloth and wash this and you can use this as your beautiful charger for for Christmas this is such a beautiful color and I made like a set of four but I did three for now I'm showing you this part this one I did ha I haven't put epoxy on it yet guys uh, it's a whole mess i haven't post a, a video for uh, like a month it's just because all my uh, mail uh, my material that i bought got lost because of hurricane iron uh, because my mail got delivered in miami it's a whole process guys so i'm buying more material right now but that's it for today guys i hope you enjoyed this video if you do don't forget to like comment subscribe and share this video with your friends and family i'll see you next week for another video but until then you know the drill be blessed and stay blessed i'll see you guys next week bye i love you Mwah!